Hello everybody, I'm Nitin and today in this PSLE 2016 Paper 2 question series, I'll be going through question 2. So in my channel, I am to help all of you master all those concepts out there. So let's jump straight into question 2, okay? Okay, so this is question 2. So this question is testing us on algebra. So let's read the question first. A pen costs $2 more than a ruler. The total cost of 4 such pens is Y dollars. Part A. Express the cost of 12 such pens in terms of Y. Part B. Express the cost of a ruler in terms of Y. So now that we have read the question, let's read the question. Hey, let's solve it. Let's solve for part A. No, we should not do that. We should highlight the key information. So a pen costs $2 more than a ruler. Okay, the total cost of four such pens is Y dollars. Part A. Express the cost of 12 such pens in terms of Y. Part B. Express the cost of a ruler in terms of Y. Okay, so this is the question. Now let's solve for part A. So we know that four pens cost Y dollar. So what does 12 pens cost? cost 3 y dollars because 4 times 3 equals to 12 and y times 3 equals to 12 it hey, equals to 3 y dollars this is why the answer is 3 y dollars so when we times 3 one side we should times 3 the other side as well that is why we get 3 y dollars so this is the answer for part a so let's move on to part b so part b first i find one pen which is y over four dollars or you could also write one quarter y okay is the same thing that is why it is y over four and one quarter y is the same thing okay so you can write either one so we know that a pen is two dollars more right so the answer should be y over four minus two but when we are expressing in algebraic form right we do not write like this so we do not write dollar y over four minus dollar two we do not write like this this is wrong because the we in our working we can write it like that but if we write this in our working after that we can write like like this you can write like that but if you write only this as the answer if you write only this as the answer it is wrong because the units are the same so you do not write it we only write dollars and then in the bracket we write it okay i've seen many teachers penalized for this kind of uh, small errors okay so when you are expressing algebraic form do not write like that okay so do keep in mind so the answer for part a is 3 y dollars and the answer for part b it is dollar y over 4 minus 2 okay so this is how you get it so i hope you understand my explanation for question 2 so thank you and bye bye i'll see you in my next video bye